Okay, cool. So, um, should we? Oh yeah, just talk about we've got someone in the back, haven't we? Oh yes. Good. Is your headdress? Check. Yeah, that. good. Put your seatbelt on. <laughs> yeah, good. And because this is a four-door car, and when you do your um, your cockpit drill. What would the first thing we begin with? Doors. Doors. So how could you check if these doors um, are? In the mirror, yeah. it's all level. It's nice and flush, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. Good. Well done. So uh, should we get going? Yes. Cool. So we're going to turn left here and then okay. I'll give you directions clear in good time. Is that all right? Okay. Good. Have we got any questions before we go out on the road? Uh, no. Okay, shall we go and do that country road that you look so good at first? <laughs> okay. Yeah? Yeah. Okay, cool. I might, so, um, let's see if I'm still good. Okay, so oh. how much help would you like with that? Um, I think I will give it a go. Okay. Um, I think I can remember the braking and the gears, so I'm... Um, Let's just put it into neutral form. Yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah. So I do my braking, and then when it's down to about twenty-three, then I can go into second gear. Yeah. Uh, to come round, and then when the what's it called? When you go round the bend. Yeah. yeah. And it opens up. Yes. Right. Yeah. Good. So you've got the limit points. That's, That's it. That's it. Limit Good. Points. So we talked about the limit points, didn't we? Um, and then. Yeah, so that's for two, there's two bends, yeah. and then once they open up, then I can start accelerating a bit. Cool, so, and yes. going up. so how much help would you like to make? Would you like to do that independently, and I'll then I just watch you, or try. do you want me to prompt you, or talk you through it? Um, maybe just prompt me if you see me doing something wrong. Okay, so just a reminder if you say, so if you have yeah. Check your mirrors as we're slowing down, okay? Yeah. So if you're going into that bend too quickly, then obviously that I can bring us to mm -hmm. slow us down or I can tell you badly. Okay. okay? Yes. Cool. Shall we get going then? Yes. Okay, cool. And it's national along here. Yes, it is. So if you look at the limit point, it's the brow of the hill, isn't it? Okay. Okay, and then I see the sight coming up, so Good. I'm checking my mirrors. Yep. distance you're keeping between the vehicle in front. Why have you kept that distance for? Uh, tires and tarmac um, so that um, if for some reason the car in front. Okay just concentrate on what you're doing. Now. Okay. So we're turning the left. What do we need on? Oh mirrors and signal. Um, what kind of roadworks? Is that roadworks as well? What kind of roadworks? Um, a mid 
can we go? Yes. That's it. Yeah, good. That's it. Well done. Get them very shaped bits, well done. And it's 30 along there? Yeah, good. We're going to be taking the next turn on the left. Before we get to that next on the left. What gear are you in? Actually? Oh, let me help you. Sorry. That's all right. Oh, did I put it in fourth? No, just want to put it over here. Yeah. What gear are you in? Actually? Oh, let me help you. Sorry. That's all right. Oh, did I put it in fourth? No, just want to put it over here. Yeah. Did I put it in fourth? You did, just by mistake. That's all right. Okay, just cancel a signal for me. Okay, so uh, how do you feel that went up until that point? Not bad. Yeah, it was, it was really good <laughs> stuff there, wasn't there? Yeah. yeah. What was you happy with? Um, I was happy with the country road. Yeah. I feel that... I think class le lesson definitely helped to build my confidence. Mm -hmm. um, so... I feel like I went in quite confident um, yeah. and remembered well what we'd done the last time. Very yeah, good. So what do you think about as we come into that 30 mile an hour speed limit, how do you feel your approach was? Um, just turn that for me. Thank you. Uh, in the 30 Yeah, mile. just coming through the country uh, road. I think 30. I probably could have started slowing down a little bit quicker there. Okay. Just obviously having a look at that sign, yeah. it's quite dirty, wasn't it? Yeah. So it's actually quite hard to see. Yeah. But if we see a red circle around it, it's obviously going to tell us there's a speed limit yeah. coming, isn't it? So you so can, we can start do, preparing. Yeah, good. So we can use observation, anticipation, and, and, and uh, sorry, awareness, anticipation, and planning, can't we? Mm -hmm. Cool. Right. So just, just um, talk about that car again, just quickly, as you saw him, and uh, yeah. you could see that he actually went over went the cab, didn't he? Yeah, good. Yeah. So we can actually use that as a learning opportunity to make sure that we take a good position when turning mm -hmm. left, don't we? Cool. Yeah. Um, also, just that roundabout, a little bit of hesitation there. Was you a little bit unsure? Yeah, I think um, the angle of how the road went threw me a little bit. Okay. Because um, there was kind of a island a little bit, wasn't there? Mm -hmm. Was there? there was or like, am just, I just there was, imagining? There were, two, there were two roundabouts. And obviously we were turning right. Yeah. So I'll tell you what, uh, what we could do is that if you wanted to go back there, we could mm -hmm. give that another go. Yeah. Yeah, okay. good. Okay, just also uh, talking about that. So was you looking right quite early? No. No. Because no. if you were looking right quite early, you might have thought, actually, it's okay to yeah. go. But if you were a little bit unsure about that mini roundabout, that's probably why you've hesitated, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. And okay. I, I think I thought it was a little bit further on for some reason. Okay. Yeah. Okay. And just lastly, um, I've had to intervene, uh, obviously, there. Yeah, fourth. And you, and you were saying you were doing so well with your I know, gears, I, you? I jinxed okay. it. <laughs> but you had been doing really well with your gears, so yeah. be, be proud of yourself. You've okay. done really well. Uh, just obviously, I've had to come in there. Yeah. Um, going in fourth gear around that corner, what could have been the problems that could have caused you? Um, in the high gear. Yeah. Um, not having control. Exactly, good. So trying to take a corner yeah. around that with fourth gear, what do you think could have happened? Um could have swerved on the road we could have couldn't we we could have just gone over the white line yeah we and then when and if it's an oncoming car yeah then we that could have, have caused had, an accident could have caused an accident okay if that happens again what could you do differently if you pick the wrong gear instead of struggling what could you do uh stop what you could do is you could break a little bit couldn't you yeah and if you break down quite 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 a bit mm -hmm. then clutch down and then we could go around that with the clutch down, couldn't we? Because okay. that would be more safer than just trying to go around it in fourth gear, wouldn't it? Okay. Would you agree? Mm -hmm. Cool. All right, so, uh, yes, yeah, so I've had to intervene. Um, just next time, obviously, um, hopefully that won't happen yeah. again. 
Uh, but uh, obviously we've come to a nice stop here. So I that's why I've just pulled you over. happens at least once a lesson. Yeah, <laughs> Getting good. it in the wrong gear. That's all right. That's I'll, okay. I'll get there. That's all right. Yeah, because normally your gears are really good. So uh, we, should we go back to that mini roundabout and have another go? Okay, Would yeah. Would you like to do that? Yep. So what you're gonna do? Well, so I'm gonna edge a little bit. Good. That's it. Can you edge a little bit more? Yeah. So we're doing a bit of peep and creeping here, aren't we? Right. It's clear from that okay. way. I think it. Oh, he's gonna turn. Sorry, I hesitated. It's okay. It is difficult when there's. It is. Cars parked. I had time to go there. It's safe. Better to be safe than sorry, isn't it? Yeah. What's it like after that? Oh, no. Bam. Bam. Okay. Right, after this. Yeah, good. Very good, that's it. Good. Well done. And it's 30. Okay. I'll just observe with that, okay? So I'll give you that direction again. Mini roundabout, turn right, and then turn left. So I'm doing mirror, mirror, signal, yeah, and now okay, I'm changing, I'm going to change into the first, I think, okay. because that white one is going to come over, and now I can go, okay. and I you can turn left here, okay, and now left, can we go? Yep. Good observations there, well done. And now I've got strapped. Oh, sorry. Okay. Now I've got strapped. Oh, sorry. Okay. Okay, we're going to be taking the next turn on the left. Next left. Oh, I didn't notice the, if it was 20 or 30 here. Just keep going for a moment. Ah, where that van is. Yeah, that's correct. Yeah. Right, so mirror, mirror, signal. Mirror again in case there's any pedestrians. Good. Keep it nice and tight. Yeah. Check me in the mirror. And then just pull up on the left for me when it's safe. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Good and secure the car. Okay, good. So, um, okay. how did that go? Better. Okay, good. One. Yeah, good. So there were some good observations. Yeah. You were reading, reading it very well, weren't you? And you turned right nicely and then went left. So there's a couple of things that you pointed out. Yeah. You went, oops, there's a cycle on the road. Oh, yeah. yeah. Yeah, good. So what do you think that means? Uh, that it's also a cycle lane? Yeah, so we can bikes and go there as well. Okay. okay, good. What else? What else did you say? You didn't see the speed limits. Yeah, I, on the, um, just 
after the roadworks, I missed the um, I'd missed the speed limit sign. Okay. Um, had there been any speed limit changes? Because you saw a speed limit and you told me it was 30? 30. Okay. Had you seen any more? No. Okay. So, so maybe I didn't miss it. Maybe it just it is because there wasn't, wasn't one. Okay, good. So I've had to intervene a little bit there. So you're getting a little bit too close to that curb and yeah. I've just come in and pushed you away from there. Can you understand why I've done that? What was taking your distraction away from getting too close? Was it the traffic lights? Possibly... The, yeah, because I think where the roadworks were close to it, I think that it was just a lot going on in my vision. And okay. um, yeah. Okay, cool. Right, so we're just going to come out a roll now. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> right. I love when you say that. <laughs> Are you oh, just attentive? <laughs> yeah, yeah, with this is all attentive. Do you mind if I had to have you a quick some drink? some actor from a local. <laughs> <laughs> Yes, actually, I, uh, I'm a professional yeah, yeah, yeah. driver. Yeah, yeah. She, have, you heard of the, have you ever heard of the stick? There yeah, you go. I'm one yeah. of them. One yeah. of seven. Is there seven of them? Apparently, I didn't yeah. That. Okay, right. Can we just review how that went, Howard? So I see him making loads of notes. I'm like, oh, Christ. Oh, Christ. Yeah. I'll roll. Because he's this, this is the master. Don't say that. This is the master, so. Your yeah. turn's being No, I won't be saying that at all, but. No, I won't. <laughs> no. Okay. Yeah, he's held a full license for 25 years. Yeah, yeah. He doesn't have the seatbelt up. Does she not? Well, observation. Yeah. Good observation. Well done. So, all right, so you want me to. Yeah, just to give right. her. So yeah, I've, I've made some notes. Yeah, we've both been naughty. You'd like me to share what I've got, yeah? Yes, what please. Got, yes, what, yeah, that's what we need. All right, so, Feedback. So, looking at faults... Or, should I start with you now? Yeah, <laughs> yeah, please do. Yeah. As soon as you've just been active, you won't get... Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, so I wrote down... Like, if, I'm thinking like with, as if I was an examiner. Yeah. If you were doing your driving test, where would be a fault? Okay, yep. Because obviously they're the things that we're thinking to develop you on. Yes, yeah. Did I do any serious? <laughs> um, well, there was intervention. So, so that we, is... Like, Abdul with the fourth yeah. gear. So we, we're just going to go through them in order. Okay. Points. So the first one I got, and that Abdul spotted, is mirrors um, coming into that speed limit. You know that where you brake quite hard yep. into that 30? So I'm going to that. Mm-hmm. And actually, before that, I just wrote that down first. You know, on the first sharp bend, yeah, you went left. So you know, you you, you talked about limit points. You know about that. Mm -hmm. So it wouldn't be worthy as a fault because I thought you went around there at an okay speed. Okay. So if you, I don't know if you can remember that. So if you can into it, you're probably. And then you got new. You changed again. You break. I think, think, oh, this is quite sharp. Did you think, oh, yeah, sharp? I remember braking more. So you, you brought in the brakes just again. So so it's not a biggie, because you did go around at the same speed. But if you were, if Abdul was searching for things to develop you on, mm -hmm. then maybe that shows that you've misread the limit point. Okay. Because if that's... I should have finished still my braking. It, yeah. You just want to hold the brakes. And then when it moves, gear and follow. Right, okay. So I always compare it to like imagine you're going down the road and there's some slow car in front of you mm -hmm. and you're going at the speed limit faster than it. And then you catch up. You're trying to keep a safe distance. You want yeah. to get right up his arms. Mm -hmm. You won't hope. He might, he might. <laughs> if you're the stick, he might. <laughs> so you'd keep you like your two second gap, your safety. Yeah. Margin. So if it suddenly stops, you can stop safely. Yeah. So you'd catch it up. So think of the limit point like that. And then, so you've gone in a bit close and you had to brake, readjust your brake. Yeah. So if if you were getting that right, you'd keep that safe distance and then you'd wait for it, the car to move. And then okay. you'd think, oh, do you know what? I'll take a gear and I'll follow. Yeah. So it could have been better plans. Okay. It could yeah. Have been, yeah, if you were looking for perfection. Yeah. I think, oh, there's an opportunity there. Whether that you need a whole lesson on it, whether you need to score it, it's questionable. 
can't think. I just made it. It's worthy of me, mate. Okay. It's worth just... And then the next bend, we went under, under the bridge. Now, it felt like we were quite fast. It felt like the tyres were just hanging on the, on the limit of our bridge. Did you feel the car like the bridge? Go a bit? Uh, at one point, a little bit, yeah. Because like, we... The, you, you can feel the tyres sort of scrubbing on the tarmac as you went around the corner. Like it was a bit, it wouldn't, the car wanted to go straight where we're going around the bend, so it just felt a bit quick. Okay. So again, not drastically, not like all oh, fault, but if that was raining. Yeah, then it could have been a different you know, scenario. If we did that yesterday when we had all the torrential rain yeah. at that speed. And if, then if you brought the brakes in on the bend to adjust it, then I think we would have skidded. Right, okay. Yeah. So I think that would be worthy. So like, sort of on Abdul's side, mm. I think that would be worthy of like, oh, do you know what? Maybe there's a lesson in that. Right. In sort of, have we nailed limit points? Have we got the speed and gear right? Mm -hmm. Okay. So because I'm thinking what, so I've never seen the time. So, so that's what I've got based on what I see. So oh, it might be a lesson in that, okay. or part of a lesson in that. But the, the fault one was the mirrors. But it was a heavy break, and so with yeah, that, it so was. Abdul's yeah, side, I should have gone into a bit more risk. deeper. Yeah, yeah. Like, I, you know, if hand, I, don't, I would talk to you. Did you check your mirrors? Like hand on heart. Yeah. What the be the risk if if you see a speed limit plate and you, and you you've got yeah. someone behind you break sharply, or you know what what, yeah. what should you do? What would be the best? Thing yeah. to do because it might mean you go in there a little bit quicker rather than break hard. Because mm -hmm. yeah, if you've got depending you on right how decision, close they are, you know, yeah, just to break suddenly. Yeah, but they they might think you're brake checking them and might like, get annoyed with you and or just hit the back of you. And yeah, think you did it on purpose. So, so I would. Um, then the fourth gear thing happens. So yeah, good inspection. Um, so then, so because you pulled up, I would have just started with that. I would have got straight onto that. Oh, straight onto that, yeah, okay. And um, the freshest thing because, first, yeah? Because in the new test, not like yeah, we're doing, talk to the part dilly dally, we're like, if he's going to stop, he's got a minute, two minutes go. So you haven't got time to go. No, to run the other side. Be like, if, yeah, if he's safety critical, i.e., he had to intervene and yeah. potentially could have gone wrong, then it'd be like, talk about it get going so um but what wasn't told when he did talk about when so he hi Adam yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> is and what and I'll, I'll ask you Natalie it's because because Abdul asked you which one could be the possible risk of going around there and fall but yeah. you said it was like not car control something like that so uh, yeah losing but control. had Abdul not intervened what think would have what would the car potentially have done? Uh would I have stalled have, as well? Could have done. So if it's stalled, what's gonna happen to the car? Well you're gonna be in a could potentially be in a dangerous yeah. position. Yes, yeah, so it's gonna stop it. Yeah. When you stall, do your brake lights come on? No. So if you had a car behind you and you stall they might not they're going to be like, whoa. Yeah. They're getting warning about that. What just happened yeah. there? So they and if they're blinking in that moment, then that could be the difference between an accident or not. That's it. So you've got that risk. That's more of this. Yeah. And also, if it didn't stall, what's the fourth gear that gives you speed to clutch up? Let's say the car survives the stall. How does it feel when you're in too high gear? What's the car trying to do? What's the car want to do with it? Speed up, yeah. So you'll get the car would pull you, right? Yeah, it'd leave a stall or it'd give you a massive pull, yeah. And potentially, so the car control side could have gone wide on the other side of the road if there'd been a park car, yeah. So, so that's why the intervention's needed because you yeah. could have stalled or gone wide. Yeah. So I'd have talked more about that. So more about that, that yeah. And yeah. I'd have gone straight to that and said, right, do you know what? That's the thing we're going to work on. Gear, yeah, and how we can do it. So why why did you go to Paul? Obviously, you didn't do it on purpose. Mm. Obviously, she's yeah, I've not. 
<laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. So um, what methods? Well, how was the? How could you prevent? Yeah. You know, what would you do differently next time? To make, make sure it's palmed across before palmed. going down. So that's sort of the the, the methods, yeah. the best practice. Which you do constantly tell me, and I still just grab on for dear life. Yeah. It's I think it's a bit of like. <laughs> so that could be the thing. If you were going to drive tomorrow, yeah, apples are there. You go around a bit quick. You want it, and you're like, soon you're going to have to learn. You know what? I need to get this right. Yeah. You might bash your car. Yeah. So um. So yeah. So that that would be the, the headline. Which was you were pulled up and down. Um. With, you know the junction you were peeping and creeping? Oh, yeah. <laughs> now, before you put your front of your car over the giveaway line, what could you do before you do that to get a better view? Um, lean forward? Yeah. Did, yeah. You, did you? I don't think so. Yeah, I, don't, um... I pretty much would have had my chin on the steering wheel. Okay. Like, you know, <laughs> <laughs> like I'd have been yeah. like, out as... Yeah, I think I was actually doing it. Well. And I, yeah. yeah, I said, then I was, then I was looking at how I'm thinking, right, Handel's well, yeah. quite far forward. Is, Am I blocking your view? You know, are you being um, polite, Natalie, and thinking, well, I don't want to block Abdul's for you? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no. <laughs> Which well, is obviously well, the wrong way round. Yeah, yeah, so yeah, yeah, Abdul yeah. sit back, yeah. you sit forwards, okay. and sure. get, before you stick your front out, because what's the risk if you stick your front out? Yeah, it could and, also cause you know, occlusion. But you might have had to. If you still can see, then then go for it. So the last yeah. port of call would be lean forward. Peak. It's because it's peak. Okay. And peak, yeah, yeah. And, um, and so yeah, that's just just. You might think it's a bit hair, but is that's what on the wood line? Why are we not looking for yeah. So that was that. Steering fault, obviously, just back there. It's been talked about. And then the one I'm just about to write down, just just because you know the answer. <laughs> when you're parking, yeah. how far from the junction can you be? Uh, ten meters. How far would you say we are from the junction? Uh, from the start of that junction, not the middle of it, but the start. Of it. Um, probably Is about it questionable. Yeah, possibly about eight. <laughs> Uh, 9.9 9. Yeah. <laughs> 9 and a half So like this car overtaking apart from cars coming around us there's about a hedge quite a high hedge isn't it? Yeah Is there possibly possibly a conflict if someone's going around you and someone's yeah. not taking a picture of the road So my next question would be to you, where would be a better place on this road that you could have pulled up? Um, either a little Maybe by that post there, so yeah. you're not blocking the driveway. Or if you've gone past that, where else did you pull up? Um, by that post down there. Yeah. But if you had that post there, you've got the bus stop opposite, haven't you? Which could yeah. cause a conflict. Oh, yeah. so. so what, you know, so going a bit further forwards, the next thing is Yeah. Okay. So you're going to have to talk about that. I think that was more... Obviously, that was me turning there to pull over here. It's because when I've had to come with that intervention, I thought, well, let's just pull over and talk about that as soon as possible. So, this what is, is... What was the question? What was the question? So, I can't remember. Was it pull up here or was it pull up in a safe place? No, it was pull up in a safe place. place. Yeah, yeah. Whose job was it? So, we pull up on a safe place, but it's fly. Yeah. But the response is now with Natalie to find yeah. somewhere safe. Then, if you do that well, it's like, well done, Natalie, that's a safe place. Why did you pull up here? Good job. Mm -hmm. But if it's not safe, it'd be like, hmm. Oh. Talk about out of ten, yeah. what would you give yourself? Yeah, <laughs> seven. <laughs> <laughs> uh, some of the stuff could be proactive, like at the junction. Yeah, the peep and creep. I, I, you know, if you're talking about it there and then, so what's your view? Like lean forward, like right? that's, but that's a better way. It's yeah, safe. Yeah, yeah. To pull up. The safety critical, the intervention, the fourth gear. Yeah, pull up. But just talk about that, just because time is stationary. Is yeah, is like it's the thing, get, is it? Yeah. Like a, you know, come on, we need to move, kind of thing. So you just deal with this critical stuff. Yeah. And the other stuff, deal with on the move. And like, if you think, oh, do you know, we can go around and... Yeah, so let's say the fourth gear thing. Well, so well, we'll, we'll do another one. And this time we're going to turn left 
and I want to say use your farming method to make sure you get that second gear. And you can, yeah, good, you got it, magic. Good, yeah. Let's continue. Can, can I leave that with you? Yeah, yeah. Think about it. You know, you know the risk, you got it. And then you can keep moving. So, there's something that's made me chuckle um, at the start when you were talking about mirrors in Berry. Oh, yeah. In Berry, you don't need to check the left mirror yet, but in Norwich. <laughs> <laughs> It's just that when no, you no, no, but no, not, no, not no. as much. She checks it when she oh. needs to check it, but if the, they, the, the fact no, the fact have is they've made a little update. <laughs> <laughs> don't check Perry, it, man. You don't need to check the left mirror. It's, it's, <laughs> everywhere else, in Nor especially Norwich. Check your, check your mirror because they're buggers in Norwich. <laughs> it's just like, and, I've always agreeing with it. I'm like. <laughs> No, but For I... God's sakes, don't say that in front no, of me. No, no, well, like, not you, Natalie. <laughs> yeah. But him, he should have shut you down. <laughs> <I> said, <laughs> Hang on a minute, <laughs> just Natalie, <laughs> just repeat that again. What did you say? Yeah. Yeah. Well, in Berry, don't check the left mirror as much. No, 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 no. <laughs> no. <laughs> no, Natalie, Natalie, you must have misheard me. <laughs> I've in never Berry, said that. It's like a lie detector check all test. the bloody mirrors, <laughs> not just the like. The... I'm not checking it as much as I am when in Norwich if I've got cars or bikes or buses coming up the side of me. Mm. <laughs> yeah, so, that, so that what right? that would suggest that there's a gap in knowledge and understanding why you check it. Yeah, you have to check it because of whatever. But it's because this is on our side now. It's not having a dig at you now. Yeah, it's me. It's like, <laughs> that would need to be challenged. Rewind that now. What, what do you mean you don't check the left mirror in Barry? What's that? I missed, yeah, missed yeah. that memo. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> I do need to though, because at least once every lesson, yeah. I'm, I'm getting the wrong gear, you know. Well, yeah. that might be worth talking about when you do stand checks. There's a tendency to do it. Then when you say that, at least, so what, how are you going to change gear here? He understands why you're saying that because there's an ongoing issue that you've been working on together. Because mm -hmm. he's he's not going to watch this video, is yeah. he? He ain't here. So how would he know that? Well, how would he know why you're saying Natalie? Why? Yeah, you're going to what? Natalie? How are you going to get that gear in? If you've just told him, oh yeah, do you know, there's a bit of a habit that sometimes you get the wrong gear. Yeah, we've been working on that. That could happen today, so I'm going to keep me on that. So then just, he gets why you're being corrected on that. Yeah, of course. The next right, that's Lee. Next right. Okay, good. Next. How are you going to deal with that car on the junction there? Um, I'm just going to make sure my positioning okay, is good. okay. And, uh, what gear are you going to use? First. No, 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 no. I, 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 I just I think, okay. So, first thing I'd say is just, you know, when you're stopping, you, as you're driving along, you put it first as you're moving. You'll get, try to get close to her and put it first. Yeah. And do you bring the clutch up before you start? So, so I, do I, do I don't know. Could you? Yeah. Let's say you're driving down the road into third. Yeah. And you're going to pull up. Could you just mirror signal position in um, stop? Um, yeah, you've told me that the last few lessons as well. 
Uh, to and then change. Just when you stopped. Yeah. Just come and stop in the gear you're in. Yeah. So now, like, what is so? If you can do that, what's the benefit of leaving it in whatever gear you're in? Um, both hands to get close to the you've got more control, yeah. more concentration on what you're doing. Then you did another right, <laughs> and then Abdul said, How did you feel with that? And you said, I'm oh, not as well as it could have been. Yeah. So, my question is, like, what, why? What was. What um, was right? oh, I can't remember now. Okay, don't worry about that. Coming back to the next junction, turn right again. Yep. And there was a little red car parked. How close do you think you were to that car parked? Too close. I would say. Yeah, I do remember um, passing close to a car. Yeah, I didn't what, remember if it was red it, or not. The, but that's why I thought I would all ask the one before there was a car park, and it's just parked near the junction. Yeah. Technically, so that's a bit. I think it just felt awkward with the steering. I don't think yeah. I think it was quite tight to turn with the car. Yeah. Up there. But also I thought you were close to that one as well. Okay. So I'm just gonna use a junction. I don't think we've done many right turns. Well, do you know we, why? Yeah, we, they don't have them in Berry. Bloody Berry. I haven't even yeah. noticed that. Oh. So, forget <laughs> this junction. You were turning right into there, and you've got a parked car near it. Yeah. And you've got to go around there. So, you, I think you're trying to stay too close and steering. If there's a parked car there, could you come around like that, look in, and cut the corner? Okay. Rather than try not to go that line and be really tight and awkward. Oh, okay. Could you cut the So if situation? it's what? So if it's like you can see that it's definitely clear. Yeah, if, if you get there and look, can in, you do that? It's a bit like when you come up to junction and turn close right. to it. Rather than try and mm. get close to this car and not cross the, that line. Yeah. Which is like trying to thread it through a really weedy <laughs> little gap. Yeah. Could you look in? Don't blatantly cut. Could you put your car sort of on top of it like that, like I've drawn there? Right, Just okay. to get yourself round without getting your wheels... Because it, it felt like you kind of did that. Right, OK, yeah. Did you say? And that's why I think I all said, how did that feel when you went not as good as it could be? Because you had to, like, yep. a lot of steering that you sort it's of spun out yeah. because of that car. You didn't look and make sure that was coming yeah. in, but you'd yeah. have to make sure they're not doing that before you turn, yeah. rather than try and do that. OK. So you can make a smoother line. Yeah. It. So that's why I was thinking, oh, I have to ask a good question because it did feel awkward. It did, yeah. And then, then we just got close to the next park car and I'm thinking, oh, there's a thing there. Yeah. Are you are you more concerned about not cutting corners and getting very close to park cars? Yeah. Or would you rather give the car more clearance, cut over white paint and yeah. look and make sure it's safe? Yeah. So it's like making that decision, what's the safest thing to do? Because yeah. what's the risk if you do go next to a park car? Well, yeah, are you going to damage their car or your car, yeah? Yeah, someone, someone's inviting me in the back, not looking. I've yeah. got a mirror, I could just open that case, yeah. open the door. Cool, should we go and do that again and see how we can deal with that? Yeah. yeah good. So, yeah, they'll, they'll all be gone now, the park car. Yeah, yeah. Yes. So, so um, remember last time you thought you said, oh, I forgot to put a signal on. Oh, yeah. When would we put a signal on? When there's people or cars. OK, cool. Which there are. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So at the crossroads, we're going to turn right. Okay. So I'm checking my mirrors, and I'm signalling, signalling, signalling <laughs> now okay. because of the um, uh, the no the um, driveway. Okay. I'm just waiting until. After the driveway. Okay. Um, okay. So that people wouldn't think I was turning into the driveway. There we go, I got my sentence out. We're, we're, we're gonna have, we'll talk about that, okay, just when we pull over next time. Do that again. Okay. So, what mirrors are you checking? Uh, centre and right. Good. 
the signal, the signal on now. Okay, we'll start to bring in the brakes. And we're going to start positioning ourselves across. Just check the mirrors again. Good. And then, is there anything coming? If no. not, we can turn it, can't we? Good. Well done. And then just pull up on the left here. Okay. Remember what I said? Just stop in the gear that you're in to clutch down. And you choose the space. Okay, good. Well done. Okay, so just so what we could do is we could go around again and see if you can do that independently. Would you like to give that a go? Okay, yeah. Okay, good. All right. Okay. Get the air con off. <laughs> yeah, do my checks. Okay. okay. Did you notice that? Oh, I didn't signal. Sorry. What is important that we signal? Uh, to let other people know what you're doing. Your intentions, right. Good. So at the crossroads, we're going to turn right. I'm going a bit slower here. Is, is that the car you had mentioned, Howard? Yeah, that was the yeah. one. Okay. And that is the one you were really close to. Oh, I didn't see. He looked over his shoulder. 